Good morning guys, this is Shardiva coming at you with a vlog today and I'm going to school today and I'm going to take you with me on campus like I always do. Um, I wish I had you guys with me yesterday. I did a science presentation, presentation and I was really, really nervous about that. It's not like I hate speaking in front of people, but you know, everybody have the fear of speaking in public. So I was up there. I was nervous at first. I was like this. And then I was like back to normal again. But I wish I could have taped it, but I didn't. So I'm sorry, guys. Um, but I will take you with me today on campus. So that's a good thing, right? Oh my god, my hand is in the video. I'm so sorry. Um, yeah, I will take you with me today. So use the light. There it, there it goes. My room is a mess, so excuse my room. Um. Oh, I'm about to leave. It's a sunny day, thank God, because my other two videos, it was raining. So, I'm going to show you my outfit when I get to school. It's this red pants and this shirt and my leather jacket. And that's it. Thanks, guys, for being with me. Bye-bye. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Okay, headed to the cafeteria. Um, I was running late today. Traffic was crazy. I didn't know, like, it was much for the accident or something. It was that bad. But I'm going to get the to get me an orange juice. And I'm taking a Excedrin and a huge headache. It's nobody in the cafeteria. That's the first. <laughs> Leaving, going straight to the Actually, I might go upstairs. Hey guys, so I'm in the student lounge. I don't know why I'm so quiet, but um, yeah, I got my orange juice and my Nutri-Grain. My hair looks a mess. Of course it does. I'm the only one in. Anyways, it's Wednesday, and I absolutely hate Wednesday classes. I hate everything about Wednesday. And I'm a Gemini, so it's supposed to be like one of my lucky days, but this Wednesday thing is getting on my nerves. Wednesday class, the, um, well, my teacher, I don't like my Wednesday teacher, um, He's insane. My second teacher, second class, she's okay. But the day seems to drag so badly on Wednesdays. Like, it's it's ridiculous. Like, the day is, like, so boring and so long. Like, it's, like, annoying. And I just want to get home and get rid of it. So, if I seem a little groggy today or groggy, don't mind me because I have a huge headache. I'm going to take an extra for it. And I'm going to show you guys my outfit later. But, you know, I've got to be honest with you. I mean, for a, a 9 o'clock class, people really should be on top. Because, you know, it's not like you're coming, anyone's coming from another job, right? I mean, people are coming straight from home, right? So it's like, all you have to do is figure out how long it takes uh, and, and just, you know, you know and, and, you know, Figure out in the event that you know there's a there's a traffic jam. You know you, you actually you should actually you know figure that in to your your calculations. You know just in the event that you do run into a traffic jam or whatever, you're still going to be on time. So I really don't understand this this tardiness here, but I do appreciate uh, all of you coming here on time. Hey guys, so this is my outfit of the day. I'm trying to go all the way back so you can see it, but you probably can't. So this is my outfit, red pants and this shirt, it's really cute, and today was an alright day in school, um, it wasn't good, it wasn't bad, it just dragged, it dragged a whole lot, like everything dragged throughout the day, I told you, Wednesdays is my bad days, like, it drags a lot, but um, the funny thing is like a girl, 
we were throwing questions in class about the readings we did for homework and the girl we everybody had a group and we all had to read the questions so um this girl she's reading the question out loud and she's like stop in the middle of the question she's like i'm sorry these questions are really stupid these questions are retarded like who did these questions and the teacher's like Oh really? So the teacher, the teacher is the one that gave us questions. She's the one that made up the questions, but she's like insulting the teacher, like in front of everybody. And I could see the teacher's face turn really, really red, which was a funny moment but an awkward moment at the same time. I'm like, oh my god, how can you do that? Like that's so disrespectful and so insulting. But you could see the teacher was like mad, and she's really young. Like she's only twenty. The teacher is only twenty eight years old, so. She's hip and she has like a little attitude. So she's like, okay. So throughout the classroom, we watched a film and the girl that questioned, and the girl that insulted her was like on her phone and she was like, can you get off the phone please? The teacher was like throwing shade back at her. So I was like, oh, I see the shade. And it was catty, like a bunch of cats in there. It was really catty today. And I'm like, I think I'm in, a, on, in between a wrestling match. I don't know. And she was giving her a side look and I'm like, oh. So at the end of the class, the teacher says, we don't, we didn't originally have homework, but at the end of the class, the teacher puts on the board, oh, this is what you guys doing for homework since my questions are stupid. This is what you guys going to do. You're going to do the readings at home, and then you're going to make up four questions of your own, and I want it emailed by this certain time, and it's going to count towards your grade because I'm grading it. And I was like, well, this bitch. Not the teacher, but the fucking student. Why would you do that? I'm like, oh my gosh, she messed everybody up. And everybody's like, thank you. Thank you for your stupid comments. If you thought the questions were stupid or retarded, keep the fucking keep your thought or comment to yourself. You don't insult the freaking teacher. So now we all have to pay for what her little comment was. So that was retarded and it got on my nerves after that. I'm like, really? You're not supposed to say things like that out loud. Like, you talk shit after class. You talk about the teacher after class. If you think this shit is stupid, talk after class. And it's not that she thought it was stupid. She didn't understand the question. So she should have just said, oh, I'm sorry. I don't understand your questions. Instead of saying, I'm sorry. These questions are stupid. These questions are retarded. Who does these? Like, so that was my little drama for the day. And I'm drama out. Because I told you I was, I had a headache. My headache was gone. I had to get me a Pepsi. So I'm gonna head to the mall with my mom after this and a little food shopping so I'm gonna record that as well but that was my day basically and my first teacher the first period teacher which I can't stand him he's doing a midterm on the book that we're supposed to read at home and he doesn't do any lessons from the book no reviews no nothing so it's like So he's on a midterm on stuff that we haven't even reviewed in class. He gives te he gives lessons on some other stuff, but it's not going to be on a midterm. So I'm definitely going to complain about him because that is just ridiculous. You don't review the text. You don't go over the text. We don't read the text in the classroom. We don't do the questions in the text. So why are you having a midterm based on the textbook? I'm, um, I'm just waiting for traffic to calm down then I'm gonna hop in the car. I got healthy food and I'm gonna show you. I got fruit and I got salad. So I'm definitely gonna show you um, what I'm eating right now.